Hi guys, welcome to the Miles Baylor channel. Thank you for stopping by again today. Today's video is all again about design R and uh, some of the features and tips on how to change things. So once you've entered your um, dashboard, you can see I've got lots of uh, ebooks open. We're going to go in and we want to review one. So we're going to look at the grow this visit. So we roll over and we've got an opportunity to preview it. We have an opportunity to rename it if we've decided the name is wrong, and delete it. We can duplicate it if we like it as well. So some really funky um, actions up front. We can also open it as a PDF. We can open it as a flip book and uh, generate a flip book in code. So loads of things that we can do off of here and generate a 3D cover. So these are some really fun after uh, market options once you've created your book. But today's tip is about um, going in and having a look and doing some editing. So we're gonna edit it. And today's tip is we're going to look at changing all the footers. Now this is again a fun thing that the way they've set this up is that it links through everywhere. So we can scroll down. Now the first page header, however, is a heading and a, page, a cover page footer. So we can't actually change that to be default all the way down. But this is where we can have some fun. If we want a standard book, we can edit the footer and the page header. So let's have a look at this one here. So we're gonna go in here and we're gonna open it and we're gonna edit it. This is the link that it's checked to, so we like that. What we're actually going to do is we're just gonna come off of here, and we're gonna then edit the actual footer. So we could change this here. Let's say it's Colin Miles, a Miles Better Business Coach and Mentor. All right, now that's okay there. So we've changed that one, but if you scroll down, it hasn't changed this one. All right, now we want it to be our footer for all pages. So we come back up here, this is where it's really fun. That when we click on this again, on the here, this button here, this little square, as it opens up, you can see they give you the hints, apply text to all footers. So we can click that. It says, are you sure? And then OK. And hey, presto, a Miles Better business coach and mentor, a Miles Better business men coach and mentor. And we can do exactly the same thing with the sec with the header here, and the fact that we can change it edit it and again here clicking it would you like the header to be all of the same and we would go okay now i haven't actually edited it so it is all the same but you can see i did that earlier so there you are guys two really simple easy tips on how to change and edit the header and the footer and then have it cascade all the way down your document which is pretty key if you've got a 30 40 page document we hope you enjoyed this tip if you did please share or like it uh, if not obviously also please I always get this wrong here we go please subscribe in the button below and uh, you have a great day guys catch you on the other side